Antelope Valley College will reopen tonight after a threat forced all classes to be canceled all day long. The texted threat prompted the school to cancel classes at the main campus in Lancaster and its campuses in Palmdale and at Fox Field. CBS 2's Christy Fajardo has more on the threat and the school's response. An eerie silence at Antelope Valley College. No buzz of students, only the hum of squad car engines. This morning, the college sent messages via text and email notifying students classes at all the campuses were canceled. Those who didn't get the message, like Sean Villar, found blocked entrances and deputies everywhere. So that's crazy, though. I just feel like they're just trying to scare people. Maybe he didn't want to come to class. If that was the intention behind some ominous messages, it worked. The sheriff's department says on Monday night, several students got texts like this one, reading in part, I was put here for a reason, and that reason is to warn you of a horrible disaster that will happen in your Antelope Valley Community College around 945. We really, from the beginning, got the sense that it didn't seem to be that credible of a threat. But in the early morning hours, we had limited information, and we felt that the safest thing for us to do was to cancel classes. The college says it alerted about 14,000 students of the decision, but night classes will go forward. Worried students took to the college's Facebook page, leaving messages like this one. They think I'm going to my night class today? They are crazy. Another student wrote, my class doesn't let out until 10.05 and I do not feel safe walking to my vehicle alone. I would say to them that we took this threat seriously and Sheriff's Department is on campus. They have a beefed up presence. There's going to continue to be a beefed up presence um, when we reopen campus. The Sheriff's Department is still investigating and says it has yet to track down whoever sent the messages, but says that person could face charges of making criminal threats. The Sheriff's Department also says it completed a sweep of the campus and found nothing to alarm them. In Lancaster, Christy Fajardo, CBS 2 News.